I'm Courtney Gleaton, the Injury Prevention Coordinator for Orlando Health, Arnold Palmer Hospital for Children. Concussions can occur in various ways throughout your child's life. Although there are no concussion-proof helmets, encouraging your child to wear their helmet while riding anything that has wheels can reduce the likelihood of a serious brain injury and or skull fracture. Always using an age-appropriate and size-appropriate car seat and or booster seat can reduce the severity of injury in the event of a crash. Choose playgrounds that have shock-absorbing surfaces like rubber, sand, or mulch. And be sure that your children are using age and size appropriate equipment at the playground. Children are more likely to get a concussion from using the monkey bars, climbing equipment, or swings. So if you think your child has a concussion, what should you do? Not all signs and symptoms warrant medical attention. So we really recommend close observation. However, there are some severe signs and symptoms that you wanna be aware of in case you do need to seek medical attention. It would look like headaches that are not controllable with medication, vomiting that does not stop, and changes in vision. 